Om Shri Sai Ram. I offer my most humble and loving pranams at the divine lotus feet of our dearest Lord. People from hills believe in a saying, "Ek bar ko zindagi ma sabhi gori rakhnu parcha." That means there's one life and we should experience everything. And the other saying goes like, "Bhagwan, jo to budo baera." Aile samay cha. That means God would that we should experience in old age. Now we have time. So, what is the real purpose of life? Is it just to experience everything in life? In Hinduism, we believe in the karmic cycle. That is, life after death. So, the real purpose of life actually should be to attain moksha. or the end from the cycle of birth and death one day a man wanting to know the secret for moksha walks up to a zen master and very humbly asks master may i know the secret for moksha hearing which the master gives no reply the man repeats his question many times but he gets no reply finally irritated he asks loudly Master, why don't you tell me the secret for moksha? The master very calmly replies, "May I know where did you leave your slippers five minutes back?" The man now is shocked. Here he is asking a question of the highest importance, and master is asking him a very trivial question. The master goes on to explain. When you can't remember what you did 5 minutes back how is it that you are capable of attaining moksha the power is living in the present that is now when in life you know you have reached the highest point and everyone is cheering for you remember this too shall pass when you are at the lowest point and you have no one with you remember this too shall pass everything is just fleeting clouds and everything is just temporary we should know that we have to live in the now in the present experiencing spirituality and godhood right at an old age is just like buying a comb when you have no hair left the myth that people believe that spirituality or godhood is only for those who have reached a certain age is totally false having faith and belief in god right from an early age gives us the right mindset and a right path in life so the only requirement that we should have is believing that everything has a purpose we should have faith in the lord and finally transformation change could be hard at first messy in the middle but it will always end in a gorgeous way we should always believe that there is a purpose for us and we should lead into that purpose thinking that our main purpose is to attain moksha and that everything is just passing clouds